Okay, true story. So Sunday, my friend Amy and I went out to a place called Payne, P-A-Y-N-E, Payne Springs. And it is about an hour and a half southeast of Dallas. So we went out to the country. And Amy is adopted. She's my age, but she was adopted when she was a baby. And so we were going to see her grandmother and her mother that gave birth to her, not the family she grew up with. And her grandmother's aunts and her mother's sisters and their kids. And she only sees them about once every three or four years. She goes out there and she sees them. So she doesn't see them a lot. She knows what her birth mother, her biological mother looks like because she talks to her regularly on the phone and Facebook and all that. But her great aunts and her grandmother who are kind of old, older in age and all have, you know, white hair and stuff. She doesn't see them a lot. They kind of, if you're passing them real fast, it might appear to be them and not them. Anyway, so we were driving and we have Siri, you know, on our little phone telling us where to go. I don't know if you've ever been in the country and Siri gets confused because the roads aren't marked well and she says turn left, turn left, you're now off course and all that. Well, we kind of got a little lost and Amy almost hit this little car. So she pulls off the side of the road real quick and when that car passes us, she goes, oh, that's either my grandmother or one of my great aunts because she saw the older lady with white hair. She goes, I'm so embarrassed because we were right behind them and when we pull in the driveway at their house, they're gonna know it was me and they're gonna know I'm a bad driver. I'm so embarrassed, I couldn't let that happen. So we sat there for a little bit and let some time go by and let them get on down the road and then we started going. So we went into this old neighborhood and uh, they lived in a trailer home. Nothing wrong with living in a trailer home, but let's just say they were not ready for company. And this was be like, 10, 15 people there. And you know when you are ready for company, how your mama cleans the house? Well, they were not ready for company. So we get out, there's only one car there, this little car we almost hit. And we get out and we are literally stepping over this big dog bowl full of water out on the porch. There is a pile of clothes on the porch that is wet from rain. There's boxes and junk everywhere and I'm thinking, there's elderly people coming to this lunch get together and these people have stuff all over the porch and somebody could get hurt, but okay, whatever. So we step over it. This is my friend Amy. And this little girl, a little younger than y'all, are about y'all's age, sticks her head out and says, hello. And my friend Amy, standing just like that, she says, we're late, but we're finally here.